I was thinking about solo front landing my Amumu, but this is probably overall a little bit stronger. Also, I'd get stunned by the target dummies. I think I win. Like, I think he got a little bit stronger, but he didn't hit Jin too, so I'm, I'm probably fine. Oh, I missed my stun though. All right, what are the odds that it's a cannon one diff? Oh, I think I lose. Oh wait, actually, hang on. All right. Ah. Nice try. Oh, what the? Wait, what the heck? Wait, something's wrong with my game. Oh my god! Holy shit! Did you uh, did you see that? That was really weird. My mouse is like off center or something. I thought I set my settings correctly yesterday. Hmm. I guess I didn't actually launch the game because you can't launch a custom TFT game. All right, hopefully it's all fine now. Well, that was scary. Oh, what the hell? What? What just happened to my game? What? What? Wait. What the? Okay. I'll figure it out after I pick my augment. I don't want to, like, potentially screw something up here. That's jazz. No, not in this part. Salvage bin so I can summon whatever I want. Okay, I'm glad I didn't crash or anything. Okay, so this is actually gonna be a pretty hard game mentally. Salvage bin equals you can play almost anything from any spot. I should have to keep a good mental track of what I have. I've got bow, bow, rod, tier. It honestly looks like a disco game. Okay, hang on. A little bit less of a disco game now. Could be an Ari game. Let me scout. Not sure. AD. Open fort, maybe Jax. Open fort, maybe Jax. Uh, this guy's not even, oh, Twin Terror, Twitch. Open fort. Disco. Okay, I'm slamming everything because it's salvage bin. I've got kind of a disco angle, kind of a Ari angle. Ari is always so contested. Sorry, I have alerts off, or I can't open my Twitch chat, so I, I can't reply to this. I'm sorry. It's nice that I can slam Gwinsu and then fix it later. is super good here because I have a front line. Oh, here's Disco if I want it. Rod, Rod. No, Bow, Bow, Rod. Tear Belt. Oh, I actually have really good items for Disco. Okay, I actually have like a really good disco pivot. T 
two Namis, two Terex, a Gragas, uh, red buff Archangels, and a Belt. Really solid itemization here. If I want to play Ari, I have Nashers, Tear, and half a Gunblade. It's also pretty close. I believe I'm getting a new Headliner here. Oh, there's a lot of things I could play here. I think a Kai'Sa also makes me a lot stronger. Kai'Sa for KDA and then Big Shot can rebuild the Sephelius. I think I need a sword here. Oh, okay, shit. It's probably another rod. The open forwarders are probably going to play Ari, so I'm a bit too scared of contesting that. I will play my Disco. I'm a little scared of this though, because it's actually contested. My Disco is actually contested. But I can play this for now, and it's solid. This Nami actually goes hard. But normally Nami has like this issue of like casting, uh, overkilling with her cast, but it actually works pretty well here. Okay, well, I'm pretty sure I can just... Force Disco from this spot, and it's very comfortable. This guy slammed a Nasher's Shoujin. He's probably gonna pivot. Oh, he's got Salvage Bin. Oh shit, this is the strong player. Uh, fuck, hopefully I win. If I don't win, it's not the end of the world. Don't tilt too hard. But it is huge if I can win this. Oh no. Oh, this Nami, his Nami is high rolling so hard. She's getting like the perfect bubbles to kill before my units can cast. No, it's, it's actually Nami bubble RNG diff. Oh, that's so sad. That's actually so sad. It's literally my Nami, or uh, the Nami barely killed my Lilia before she casted diff. Goodbye, five streak. Fuck, five streak actually would have been so good there. It's not the end of the world. I can figure it out. Pretty good items. Actually, very, very good items. Very good items. Oh, hey, high roll. God, I'm so sad. At least nobody has a streak. Okay, so once I break apart this Nami, I have Red Buff Archangel's Bow. So it's probably gonna be like Red Buff Archangel's Shiv. And look for a Gunblade later. I'm pretty sure the other Disco player is pivoting. I need a spell waiver here. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna I'm gonna force this. I don't feel like being flexible today. I can probably get like a good third here, at least. Okay, my tank items are good. Just think about the back line. So you have red buff, Archangel's Rod. Oh wait, sorry. I don't know why I thought it was Shiv. Uh, Bobo, Rod, Rod, Tier. Red buff, Archangel's Rod. So then you go for a Spark. Cloak on Carousel or Sword. Oh, Sword equals best in slot TF actually.
I'm not gonna lie, this Nami is really funny. Oh, what? Okay, right, well, this game just got a lot easier. Archangels, red buff. Okay, honestly, I'm not even sure if that was stronger. It might have been stronger to just keep the ultra fast fish. So what I want here, uh, sword is best in slot. Uh, bow is fine for shiv. You can also like basically slam whatever. It'd be funny to grab this Gragas. Yeah, sword if I can. Otherwise, I think it's a spark. Nice. Oh, this game is looking really good. My fans are the reason I sit. Wow. Forcing Disco? I wouldn't even say we forced it. But the game gave us a really good spot for Disco, then you hit double the funk, and then you hit a TF. The moment you play double the funk, you are forcing Disco. So then, to then hit a TF naturally is super high roll. I could honestly probably go 9. Sucks I didn't streak earlier, but it's not the end of the world. Don't tilt too hard. Focus on getting good top 4s. Oh shit. That echo is pretty good, but it's not worth losing 5 disco for. Or actually it might be, I think. I, I think it is, actually. Like, the main reason why you want to go 5 Disco is because it gives you 2 balls, but I actually don't need 2 balls here. Because of Double the Funk, they all fit into 1. I'm pretty sure this Echo is a decent improvement. Alright, let's scout. Did that guy pivot off? Who was the Salvage Bin guy? Yeah, he's pivoting off. He has his KDA spent. Cool! Uncontested Disco. This guy has got a Jin. Uh-oh. We left Jin at 7, that's scary. Oh shit. Um... Oh, what? What the fuck? Okay, well, I have Salvage Bin, right? So, no reason to not just start slamming the shit. It's probably a Shiv. I'm just gonna slam it all on Lulu for now. It could have been a Gwinsu's Rage Blade as well. But I think this is better. I could actually go 8 and then just sit. Like, don't even sell this Echo, because I naturaled everything. Yeah, I think I just go 8 and sit. No one seems too strong in this lobby. Sit, go 9. Sorry, I can't respond to any alerts. I have to have everything closed. I should probably honestly meet my alerts as well. Return on investment? No. Probably murder. Yeah, I think I level up, and then I roll for like a sentinel. 
Oh, wait. Now I shall keep rolling. Oh, fuck. This could get a little dicey. I just need, I just need one sentinel. If I was gonna roll, I probably was supposed to just sell my headliner. I was like, oh, I wanna just sit on this and go nine, but I immediately hit a TF pair. Uh, I'll do some scouting after this round. This echo is really good for me right now, though. TF some blitzcranks out. Uh, a lot of blitzcranks. All right, I will roll for TF. Okay. All right. Well, now I'm definitely just going nine. I'm like kind of thinking about selling Ari set set because do I really expect a two star Ari here? I don't think so. Let's go nine. I'm not gonna be rolling anymore. Two star Ari would be wonderful, but I'd rather just go nine up one turn faster. Because you're selling this RA for Sona immediately, because this breaks apart into a Gwinsu sh Shoujin. Wow, the salvage bin actually has gone crazy. Okay, so try to remember what we have. I have Gwinsu Shoujin here, and the frontline items have all resolved themselves. So I just grab a frontline item. Oh, I always want that. So okay. Uh, or I want like half of a Shiv. Bow is good, chain is good. Actually, I'm done for... Done for Rod. Rod can become another Gwinsu's. Rod can become a Spark. Rod can become a Crown Guard. It's probably the most flexible item here. Take my Rod, Ari. Cool, I mean, this honestly feels like a low world lobby. Like, no one's that strong. And I'm high rolling. I forced TF and I got TF. This is like what a lot of those roll downs from earlier should have been like. Well, no, this is this is way above average. Let's not kid ourselves. But like some of my roll downs in the last few days was like roll for an uncontested TF just like this and then just like never hit it. So I'm I'm very happy that I I, I hit one blitzcrank early before they're all out of the pool. And then I naturaled my TF too. I was talking to Asa last night. We had dinner. Asa recently hit rank one. I was asking him like, what do you do that other players don't? And a lot of what he said was that he he's like down to take any headliner. Or I don't know about any, but many headliners. He's down to take a lot of headliners. I uh, Oh wait, he's dead. What? Oh, I, I just beat the, the guy who got a gin. I, I'll hold it, but I'm not even convinced that you're supposed to play it. I think once you get to 6 Disco, if you get to 6 Disco, you can play Ziggs. But like this R is a little bit cuter. I also already have a Shiv. Like, Ziggs is like really not that good right now. Lots and lots of Ezreal players. Okay, I'd like to win this obviously, but I'm not entirely sure that I will. I mean, my augments are really good. Maybe. This TF Ari dual carry is kind of cool. Nice. Sheesh! I've been holding that Paris in stage two. Cool. I mean, we should go nine and then. Uh, honestly, it might be a go 10 game because I don't need a headliner TF anymore. What am I even going to roll for at nine? Well, I'll roll for one Alawi. And one Sona. But like, what headliner do I even want here? Try to keep track of my items again. Oh, we had a dupe? It could be a 3-star TF game. 
Alright, well. Oh, I can't I can't level yet. It's probably Warmogs and then GG. Is it ever another Gwinsus? But then that leaves your last item pretty awkward. The best combination of two items that I can make right now is JG Warmogs. Ah, oh, fuck. There, there's probably, if you think really hard about it and then break your Ari apart, there's probably something better, but I'm fine with this. It's definitely decent enough. Like, Ari normally doesn't want JG because she casts too slow, but she's got Disco. She'll be fine. Okay, sec 3, go 9. This dupe... Honestly means TF3 is possible. I've got a lot of HP so I can think about it. You can also just dupe for, um... Sona 2. Okay, yeah, sec 3, probably saw Echo and then find something better. Saw Echo and Mord, and then find something better. Bruiser Zac, Guardian Thresh. Uh... TF is probably TF3 at this point, because you only hit, need to hit 2 more, and it's uncontested. Looks super winnable. This RA1 is actually saving me so much HP. I think this guy's dead. She I was also holding that since stage two. Oh no, I had to rebuild my Nami, I remember now. Maybe at least a top two, and then maybe I can. there's room to try for TF3. I'll, I'll play to secure a top two. And then after that, we can start gambling for a first. Nice. Dodge the Zephyr. Okay, so what headliners are good here? Oh my god. That, that bug only happens to like 50% of players. It doesn't happen to everybody. It's so annoying. Uh, Zach is probably good. Most frontline is good here. And then TF is obviously TF3. Mm. Sentinel spat, but that's probably always gone. Try to remember... Gwinsu's... Gwinsu's Shojin JG. Oh wait, no, nobody wants a Sentinel spat? Ah, oh, shit. Uh, I, I was thinking of breaking apart that spat, but it's a bit risky. I was a little slow there. Well, at least I have HP. All right, let me get a, get a decent headliner. Okay, that's definitely decent. Uh. Okay, now I can remove Nami. Ah, uh, fuck, I really feel like I can hit TF3. 
I like, really feel like I can hit it. Or Thresh 3. I'm pretty sure I'm selling this Blitz. Maybe I'll wait a little bit. This crank's good right now. I can wait till it gets a little bit closer. This blitz crank's the literal best headliner I could get besides the three star TF and Thresh. Thresh is a little contested. This item's a little bit wasted, but whatever. Yeah, the only way I can really lose this game and like not go at least second is if I sell my Blitzcrank and then miss. I'm probably supposed to just wait. This, bo this board is so strong. It's like guaranteed top two if I just keep rolling at nine. And then playing for first would be like, oh, you're stronger than me, so now I will r give up and roll for the TF. But oh fuck, the odds of hitting a TF on there is really high. It's like really high here. Oh, did he just move into me? I could even hit a Thresh 3 once the Thresh player dies. Wait, where's the Thresh player? He might already be dead. Oh, this guy's really strong. Oh, wait. Hang on, get your cast off, get your cast off. Oh, I'm definitely losing this fight. I'm like, oh, I'm really thinking of selling this blitz crank. I get so much weaker the moment I do, though. Oh, he suffered my sauna. That's smart. I get so much weaker the moment uh, this happens. I don't think going 10 is ever the play, though. Just grab a full tank item. Alright, fuck, I'm just gonna do it. Actually, no. Uh, let me see my natural headliner. Okay, I'm, I'm just gonna do this, and without selling my Blitzkrank, I'll, I'll roll for it like that. I'm, yeah, I'm just gonna hit the TF without rolling for the headliner. I'm too scared of uh, selling Blitzkrank and missing. Like, it's not likely to happen, but it's the biggest throw possible. Whereas my team is still pretty good. I could just roll it down at 9 for 2 natural TFs. Natural Sona. And if I hit a Headliner Thresh, then I can just play that. Oh, it's my Disco brother. Okay, well, he's... 
This guy doesn't care if I clump or not, so I'm just gonna put TF and Sona next to each other. Uh, I'm pretty sure I have the read. He's gonna swap to this at the last second, and then I just swap as well. Oh fuck, am I gonna win without having to do my roll down? Okay. Okay, so we do have to roll down. Uh, this is exciting. Let me roll down a little bit right now. Uh, yeah, I'm down. Yeah, I'm down. One Thresh, one Blitz, one Echo, a Sona. All right, let's, let's roll pretty fast. He has one Thresh. Okay, I need two TFs or one Thresh. Okay, think, Albert. How are you going to accomplish this? Uh, I might have to sell TF. What if I just win? Oh, I I almost won, actually. That's really close. I might... Oh, fuck. If I just sell this Thresh and play any, any Headliner, I might win. Could win. Oh. oh my god. That's so sad that I actually couldn't hit it. Two fights I like almost won. By like milliseconds. I didn't even get to use my dupe in the end because I hit it I hit everything two star and I didn't get any three stars. So close on those fights. I feel like that Ziggs board is stronger than what I currently have, but I wanted to try for the headliner. Oh man. What a what a huge throw on my end. Oh my god. I fucking suck. I actually threw for the three star Giga Chad content and then I didn't hit it. I could have just played a normal board. Oh, I'm probably just won one of those fights.